No, get out of here. All right, well, I'm here on campus at the at the. Uh, You're off campus. This is on campus. This is off campus. I'm on campus at the new townhouses. So you guys saw the title, you saw the thumbnail. I'm actually gonna go around and show you guys what Division Three National Championship rings look like. First, we're gonna start at my teammate's house. His name is Tanner Slack. He also runs track here. They won the national championship, I believe, last year, and they got rings for it. So we're gonna check out the track ring first. <laughs> did you see that. the camera? I did. What's up? Oh my gosh, look who it is. The bitch. Alright. Well, yeah. can we just go up there or is it too messy? Alright. What's, so what's the video for you? Showing that what, yep. what Division 3 National Championship rings look like. Tanner has a track one. Gerard has a wrestling one. D'Angelo has a football one. I wanted to use my laptop and now he's crying about it. Oh, Nate, stop crying, dude. He's like, I'm not passing you the ball anymore. I was like, you don't pass it anyway. <laughs> Dang, Tanner, you gotta take some stairs every time you get to your room. Alright, we're entering Tanner's magical place. Puzzle. How many rings do you have? So, so this two. This, Tanner this, is won. Just a, this is just like a paperweight they gave the, like all the participants. At Tanner won a state championship in high school too. Okay. All right, so here's the this is the track one. That's the track. One. Did it feel pretty cool getting this? Yeah, it just I didn't like score any points, so it didn't feel as special. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dang. But so the this year is, that I went to nationals last year, I'm um, third. So can you take it out? Touch it if you want. I, I just didn't know. I, yeah. Cool. I, Never felt this important because I haven't won one of these. Okay, so it's got his last name on the side here. NCAA track and field, Mount Union on top. Then it's got the year, outdoor 2018. Yeah, we won indoors and outdoors that year. Oh, damn. Comment below what you guys think of the track national championship ring. This is pretty cool. Hopefully we can get one for basketball this that's, year. That's the point. And an OAC ring too. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Again, comment what you guys think of the track national championship ring. We're gonna go head over to Gerard James's uh, dorm right now. He was the wrestling national champion. So Tanner, thank you. Yep. Do you have your state championship ring too? Really quick though, I know this isn't part of the video, but here's his state championship ring for basketball in high school. I'm pretty jealous. I need to get a ring now this year, OAC and national championship. No matter what ring. though, going today, you'll be behind me. What in ring count? In ring count. Because I'm on your team. So we need to win a national championship this year. All right. Well, that's not how it works. <laughs> What's up? What's up, man? What's up, how are you? How's it going? Have you met Joe? Nah, Joe. Joe. How's it going? Gerard. What's up? This is Gerard James. He is Mount Union. What was it? What year was it? Uh, 2018. 2018 National Championship for wrestling, which is, I think that's awesome. It's obviously by weight class. So you yeah, won yeah. the weight class for the entire nation. Yeah. His one brother, too. Awesome. Yeah, me and my brother were national champions. Uh, I won in 2018. <laughs> he won in 2019. That's crazy. Yeah. So, let's check and it out. And I want to show you the ring. So, come on. Here's my apartment, actually. There's not like nice. much in it because. Yeah, dude, you need a couch. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> Wait, hold on, let's check this out first. This is cool. Coach Malave actually showed me the graphic for this today. I think it was for me, it was just like a pressure, was like making it to the finals again. Yeah. So like once I did, I was like, all right, yeah, I did, I'm fine. <laughs> Comment below if we should do like a sports swap where him and I have a wrestling match, <laughs> and then he plays me in basketball. <laughs> Absolutely, I would definitely. Would awesome. Here's the national championship ring for, for wrestling. Can I yeah. it? Can yeah. I yeah. <clears throat> Guys, kind of the same thing that was going on with Tanner's here, where we got the, the year um, and NCAA on the side. And then um, obviously you can see it representing Mount Union here on top on the top of the ring with national champion. Then it's got his name and then the weight class, I assume. You won't be able to see it very well on video, but it's actually got his full name right here on the inside of the ring too. What was your feeling when you like got the ring specifically, not so much the actual champion? I was like, wow, this is dope. I felt like LeBron. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's like, right. Cleveland, this is for you. And I was like, oh yeah, this is for you. <laughs> <laughs> no, but for real, because like for so long, like Mount Union hadn't had a champion. Mm -hmm. We hadn't had a champion in like 20 years. So me coming in in 18 is like I changed the game for everyone. Like, yeah. yeah, that's crazy though. Well, I appreciate it. Yeah, Thank man. you. 
Congratulations, even though it's a couple of couple <laughs> years back. I bet you it hit ceiling. Yeah, me too. We're going underhand. Ah, oh, that was close. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was actually my He said practice. Really? Gerard, thank you so much for showing us your ring. I'm obviously in a different outfit right now. That was a couple days ago. I was trying to get a hold of D'Angelo the other day, but he finally texted me back tonight. And so I was like, all right, I'm gonna shower up real quick and then finally push out this vlog. So the idea behind the vlog was actually kind of quote unquote originated from the football team because a lot of people know Mount Union from the football team and all the national championships. So actually the last national championship ring that we're gonna go see is one of the football players. He's actually a starting quarterback. You guys actually met D'Angelo in the vlog where I showed you guys the inside of a Division Three football locker room. So we're gonna go to his townhouse right now, which is actually on campus. It's right over there. Hey, I think I'm right outside of your front door, actually. <laughs> How are you? Good, I'm good. Yeah? You're on the vlog? You got anything to say? Here's the ring you asked for. Oh, that's the ring. <laughs> this is D'Angeli. You guys saw him in the locker room vlog. Starting quarterback here, how'd the first game go? Was the score again? 62. Or 66-14. Yeah, it was pretty good. It was yeah. good. It was a good, uh, good game to set the tone in, for sure. If you're watching this, be at the game. If you're not at the game, find a way. <laughs> Check it out. I'm a national champ now. <laughs> Thanks for letting us come over here. I'll see you sometime soon at the BW game. I got the horses. Just lock them up. Lock them up. <laughs> lock them up. <laughs> this is the national championship ring right here. Let's uh, make sure we're in some good lighting. Um, so. Uh, I guess to kind of to break it down a little bit um, in comparison to the track ring that I showed you guys and the wrestling ring um, This one looks like it has a little bit more detail and it's a lot bigger and heavier So basically well on this side, so we obviously you have your player thing mine is d12 um, My last name our Raiders helmet and then the year and then like ingrained on the side is the um, It's God family football, which is like our team mantra you guys probably saw in the other vlog. The, uh, right here, too yeah, so it's everywhere. On the other side, we had like our saying for that year and it was against the world. You know, we had a lot of different things going against us in 2017 and we just felt like everybody was against us. They couldn't figure out what they wanted to put on the ring. So they basically just put the Stag Bowl trophy with the Raiders thing going across. Like it even says NCAA. Diamonds all around it, uh, national champions um, going on the sides in gold and the rest of the ring is silver. And then we have our own thing. Mine was Romans 828. So are you trying to go by? Yeah, just some, just one of my favorite scriptures. It was a scripture that stuck out to me that year, and it was just kind of like, you know, everything kind of fit. Like, what I was going through that year personally was in that scripture, so. When he, when they won the national championship and they came back, we both lived in one of the sophomore dorms at the end of, at the end of Mount Union on campus. And he was like, he texted me, came up to my dorm room, and he opened the door, and he was like, oh, hey and like opened it really slowly. I don't know if you remember <laughs> oh, that. I got a bunch of videos, like we were doing stupid stuff like, oh, here's this trash right here, man. And you'd record yourself going to the trash <laughs> and like, yeah, man, gotta throw away things properly. I have another question. What was like the feeling when, so there's obviously a different feeling from when you actually win the Stag Bowl versus yeah. when you get the ring. So like, what was the feeling when you got the ring? Uh, Cleveland! It was kind of like I finally had something to show for it. Like, yeah, we had the trophy and I had my pictures with the trophy, but you know, I can't carry a 20 pound trophy around with me everywhere I go. <laughs> These are sometimes uncomfortable because of how big they actually are. But like I said, I can wear this out anywhere. And as soon as I shake somebody's hand, you feel the ring one, you see it. It's like, it's out, it's a conversation starter. People always ask questions about it. They're always like, hey man, what, that, where's that ring from? Like, even if I'm out at dinner and I have it on the waiters, yeah. like, Hey, where, where'd you get that? Like, you got an NFL team or something like that? And I'm like, oh, that's a national championship ring. I've been saying it the whole vlog. I need to get myself a ring this year. OAC ring and national championship ring. And I think we have to. You will. Make it happen. Yeah, it will. Real question is, are you getting another one this year? I'm not going out a loser. I put that in another vlog. <laughs> not. So you guys have to come out to a game. It's awesome. The energy there is just so live and it probably works 60 half years later. Yeah, first yeah. the first half. <laughs> and we try to put on a show and we show what our, our coaches have put, in a, uh, put us in a position to go do. And you know, that's basically what makes Mount Union. Mount Union is we got the guys to go do it. Our coaches put us in position to make plays and then we make it happen. <laughs> I'll see you later. All right, well, peace. Thanks. Now what? 
he's locked out. <laughs> Locks on him. Oh, hey, let's see how <laughs> Thank you, for real. I appreciate it. That's it. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I appreciate the support. I also appreciate Tanner, Gerard, and D'Angelo for letting me film. Again, like I said throughout the video, I will get one of those this year, hopefully. Also, make sure to stay tuned for some awesome vlogs coming up. So thank you guys for watching. <sighs> make sure you stay tuned. Stay motivated. Stay positive. Take it easy. I got the horses. I got part of the brick in my eye. We forgot to get the thumbnail, so we're running back to get a picture with the animal.